girl. I am glad you enjoying that. Mm -hmm. Matter of fact, that's gonna be $500. job since you got us fired first of all I didn't get us fired if they can't appreciate me taking time out of my busy schedule to look good for them then we don't need to work for them anyway you know what I'm with you when you right girl but what we gonna do cuz them bill collectors ain't gonna want to hear that yeah you right um so what you came up with oh hey go one right here it says Dial Walker, won't it? Um, that's a negative. Girl, you didn't even let me read the dog on description. You ain't gotta read the description. It said dog walker. I don't like dogs and I don't like to walk, honey. Mm-mm. You right, girl. Let me keep on looking right quick. Here go one right here. Caregivers need it. Uh-uh. That's a no too. <sighs> Dang, girl. You didn't even let me read the dog on description of the job. You ain't got to read the description. I use context clues. It says caregiver. I ain't trying to care for nobody else. I got two children. No, thank you. Mm-mm. You know what? You look. Rip the paper. Okay. Maybe. Possibly. I... Uh, nah, nah. Yeah, well, I tried. We're trying ain't gonna pay these bills. Ooh, girl, I got it. I got it. How about we become entrepreneurs? Remember, we tried that already and it didn't work? Well, it shoulda, okay? People out here making thousands, millions of dollars selling their hands. I don't know why it didn't work for us. My hand's pretty. Well, apparently, you the only one that think that because uh, we didn't make no money. Well, this plan right here is bulletproof, okay? We're going to make a killing. All right. What's the plan? <sighs> okay. I got it. Here we go. How about we make our very own lemonade stand? What you think? You know what? I think you a genius. Yeah, I know, right? But hold up. We don't even know how to make lemonade. Girl, you ain't got to know how to make lemonade to sell lemonade, if you know what I mean. <sighs> what is she talking about? How is we going to make lemonade without lemon? I guess we'll see. Did you hear me what I said? You ain't gotta know how to make lemonade to sell lemonade. Lemonade! Fresh squeeze lemonade! Lemonade! Come and get your lemonade! I told you this wouldn't work. First of all, the stand need to be closer to the road. There ain't nobody finna go sit in that sun. Listen, we just need a little, um, 
some advertising. We need some advertising. Let me see your phone. For what? To make a TikTok, duh. Well, wouldn't it be best if we do it from your page? Uh, you the one with the most followers. Girl, followers don't matter. Besides, I don't want to look desperate. That's what your page is for. Well, followers do matter if we want to make some money. Well, I guess you're right. But I'm doing all the talking because you know I'm the famous one. Famous and broke. Not broke. Here we go. Hey guys, it's your girl Tiara, and guess what? I got a very special treat for y'all today. Look, we selling fresh squeezed lemonade. Yeah, uh-huh. Come and get your lemonade, cause we we selling lemonade to um help the homeless. We selling lemonade to help the homeless. So come and get you some lemonade. <coughs> oh, oh, oh. Where's my manners? Here's one of the homeless people right now. You wanna say something? I shall do, I shall do. Uh, uh, y'all, listen, we really need y'all cause uh, we both. <laughs> well, that's it y'all. Come and get your lemonade for the homeless. <laughs> what you trying to do, ruin me or something? No, I was just trying to tell your friends the truth. You broke. Excuse you, I am not broke. Just a little low on funds, that's all. Just a little low on funds. Oh, look at that, it's a customer. Yeah, look who's playing work. Look who's the genius now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hey. Hey, how are y'all? I just saw me on TikTok and you wanted to come get an autograph, huh? No. I just came to buy some lemonade. I saw that y'all had some for sale. But now that I think about it, you do look familiar. <laughs> yeah, that's me, girl. Mm -hmm. It's me. I knew you knew me. I'm the one Nicki Minaj responded to. Mm -hmm. That's me. Uh, nah. That ain't it either. But anyways, uh, I'll take a cup of lemonade. Okay. She got me doing all the work. Mm -hmm. How much you don't know me? Thank you. Girl, I am glad you enjoying that. Mm -hmm. Matter of fact, that's gonna be five hundred dollars. Five hundred dollars for what? Uh, the lemonade. This is fresh squeezed homemade lemonade. Okay, we flew these lemons from Brazil. <laughs> uh, no. Nah. It's tasting real minute made to me. You know what? Y'all can keep this lemonade. I get my own. But it's for a great cause. Okay, it's for the homeless. Well, look, I ain't got no $500. But you know what? I do have something. Since you guys gonna help the homeless, give me one second. Where's she going? Hope to go get our money. I know, because she drunk some of that. She gonna give us $250 or All something. Right. <laughs> a little extra. And she spit it out. Mm. Here y'all go. Hope this helps. Look like we need some clothes. We need some money. I can't believe it, girl. Drop that clothes. And she drank some of my lemonade. That we can sell. Uh -huh. Girl, that do look a little vintage. I knew the price tag was gonna come in handy. <laughs> yeah, girl, we about to make a killing. You know what? This might be the best idea you ever had in life. I told you I'm a genius. Yes, you are. Got all this vintage stuff right here. Oh, look, it's a customer. Oh, I got a customer. Hey, y'all, what y'all selling? Uh, vintage pieces. I like this one. How much that is? Uh, it's just 200. 200? <laughs> oh, no, she's just playing. She's just playing. I'm sorry about that, mister. Um, she actually meant 500. Wait a minute. Man, y'all crazy. Ain't nobody finna pay that. Hey, what they doing over there? Are they over there selling clothes? Man, they over there scamming if you ask me. Somebody 500 for a dress. Thank you. That's exactly what I needed to know. Appreciate you. Hey, where you going? I just told you they over there scamming. Mm-mm. Don't worry about it. I got this. Ooh.
car. Get the clothes. Get the clothes. Hey, girl, you back so soon. Yeah, I'm here to get some of that lemonade. Girl, <laughs> it's all gone, girl. It's all all gone, girl. We sold it all. <laughs> we sold it all. <laughs> uh, so I guess uh, we'll just see you next time. We'll be back out here probably next week for the homeless. Mm -hmm. Well, I want to buy whatever it is that y'all selling to help the cause. Girl, you done done enough. Yeah, she did enough. You gave us these clothes to take down there. We gonna... Thank you. Wait a minute. Now I realize where I recognize you from. TikTok. You remember me from TikTok, didn't you? Cause she is a star. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so star. Star? More like scammers. What? Now I know where I know y'all from. Y'all them girls that has stole them Girl Scout cookies from them little kids. Girl, no we, we don't steal from kids. We don't do that. At least not all of them. Anyway. Yeah. Yes it is y'all. Cause I recognize them busted braids and that red raggedy weave from anywhere. I should call the police. Uh, you police? That's my cue. I'm out here. Misha, Misha, where you going? You know we got warrants. I, you know she bluffing. We gotta get this money. I can't get no money if I'm in jail. See, I knew it was y'all. I'm finna call the police. <laughs> you know what? I, I would stay here and be all cordial and stuff with you, but uh, I got to go. <laughs> hey, hey, come back here, you little scam. Previously on Scampreneurs. Wait a minute. Now I realize where I recognize you from. What? TikTok. You remember me from TikTok, didn't you? Cause she is a star. Yeah, <laughs> I'm so star. Star, more like scammers. What? Now I know where I know y'all from. Y'all them girls that has stole them Girl Scout cookies from them little kids. Girl, no, we we don't steal from kids. We don't do that. you doing girl it's this website where people are paying thousands of dollars for pictures of your hands and your feet I'm gonna give it a try <laughs> so you think people gonna pay to see those um yeah why wouldn't they you got a better idea well I would have to think of no idea if you wouldn't have got us fired <sighs> listen I don't see how these people expect me to come to work work and be on time but i ain't doing all that well the light bill do tomorrow so um what we gonna do we gonna be in the dark well i bought us some candles so we gonna be okay sierra i'm serious uh i'm kidding okay so we need to make some money what's the easiest way we can make some money i know we can have a garage sale girl what we gonna sell? Now you know we some hustlers. Now get your butt up and get around this house and see what we can find to sell. Oh, what can we sell? What can we sell? Hold on. It's deodorant. People use deodorant. It's a little used, but it'll work. It'll work. It'll work. Oh, what can I sell? What can I sell? <gasps> Got these antique pillows. Grandma made these. And they can go for a hundred dollars a set. $300 itself. Hold on, it's nice. We don't even use this anyway. Look at that. We're gonna make this money. Mm, what else? This blender. Ooh, I know they can go for about $50. Mm, what else? Oh, I ain't gonna be able to see that. Some tissue. People use tissue. They need tissue. Let's see. Ooh, we're gonna prop up food and we good to go. Yes, got it. Yeah, we gonna have our light be a money. Girl, we gonna make a kill in the day. This what I got. Hold on, that ain't it. Wait. Be in the 
the dark. Then, hold on, we're going to be in the dark, but we're going to be hungry. Hungry, you selling out food? What you doing? Well, what you got then? Well, I got some tissue. Got some? Tissue? Yeah. Ain't this the last roll? It's two ply though. We might can make some money off of it. No? Okay. I got deodorant. This might be You don't even be using it like that. Deodorant. Oh, well, wait a minute. I got this too. We don't even use this. Do we even wash our hands? Oh, we got a little soap in there. You know what? We ain't got nothing. We're gonna be living like cavemen all week long. No, we ain't. <laughs> to be buying no Girl Scout cookies. Please, man, we give you a discount. Please, please. Oh, Misha, look at her. How much? It usually be $50. $50? But y'all can give me $10. Oh, that's the deal. You got cash out. <laughs> yeah, I got that from my mama. You got it from your mama? Mm -hmm. Okay, what's your cash app? Money sign, always ask it. Money sign, always ask it. Just sent it to you. you Thank you. You're welcome. So, um, where you get money from to buy cookies? From my hands and feet pictures. Ew. They really buying it? Um, yeah. But they're not paying enough because that was my last $10. Your last $10? <gasps> what we gonna do now? I know. We can sell these cookies. See, we only got one box of cookies. One box of cookies with a lot of cookies in them. Ooh, we need to wrap them. Yeah. We can wrap them in this tissue. Yeah, you use yeah. it for something. You yeah. got one? Yeah. Man, out of all days, why I got a rainy day? Oh. Girl Scout cookies for sale? <laughs> well, I guess today ain't my lucky day. First customer! Yay! We ain't even got a wrap. We got a wrap. Let's go. Come on. Hey! Uh, are y'all selling Girl Scout cookies? Yeah, we are. Oh, uh, okay. How much are they? Oh, $50. $50? $50 for a box of Girl Scout cookies? No, not the oh, box. Okay. That makes sense. $50 for just one Girl Scout cookie. $50? Mm hmm. Each? Mm hmm. For one cookie, it's going to be $50. One cookie, $50. You got that right. Well, when the pandemic hit, we had to raise our prices up. Man, y'all don't even look like Girl Scouts. Y'all just out here scamming people. I mean, how old are y'all? Ain't you like 40? And you like you 60? Hold up, don't you be rude. You know black don't crack. Uh -huh. If you broke, just say that. Man, I ain't broke. I'm just. I'm just on your porch just because it's raining. Well, you could just get off our porch if you ain't going to pay the $50. Well, I don't want to pay $50. I'll get off. Show porch. You know what? They ain't about to sell no cookies on my watch. Nobody want to buy my cookie for $50. <laughs> All these folks are broke. Man, oh my God. <laughs> Hey, Mrs. Do you want to sell Girl Scout cookies? And where did you get that sign from? Don't you mean buy Girl Scout cookies and no, I don't want no cookies that cost $50? No, it's just 10 When did you get that idea? From them girls over there? Well, should I say ladies? Because they act like Girl Scouts, but they really not Girl Scouts because one of them like 40 and the other like 60 and they just, you know what? Just forget it. 
Okay. Yeah. Uh, where are you going? To catch those scatters! All the light bill money. We got it. And, and then some. And then some. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think they can steal my Girl Scout cookies. Mm. I'm about to show it on 4K. Oh. Eight, eight, eight. Another Exactly what I think, Miss Feet on them. Well, I had to do some. Shoot, these bills keep piling up. What you expect? I know. That's why I've been thinking. Oh, Lord. I'm good. Because you know your thinking be getting us messed up. Well, the last time I checked, it was your idea to sell the Girl Scout cookies. Well, if you wouldn't have got us fired, I wouldn't have had to do all that. Why you keep bringing up old stuff? Now I told you, that was not my fault. Whatever. But anyways, I'm good. All right. Well then, don't try to jump on the bandwagon when I become a millionaire. <laughs> Girl, you gotta become a millionaire first. Dang, get a new game. Gotta get a new game. T&M games. They must be new. I ain't never heard of them. They got PFIs on dick. Oh yeah, I gotta get one of them. I gotta get one of them. Order, yes sir. Yes sir, let's go, I'm gonna go crazy. Well, would you look at that? At my very first sale, $500 for a game system. You lying. Let me see. Oh my God, girl, you a genius. But it's only one problem. We ain't got no doggone game systems. Uh, say, say what now? We ain't got no what? We ain't got no games. Mm -mm. Hold on, hold on. Oh Lord, what is she up to? But Lord, whatever it is, Lord Jesus, please God, do not blame me. I'm just trying to get these bills paid. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. Ain't got no game system. Uh, uh, uh. What? Uh, uh. That's my baby asthma pump. She don't need it. We can get her another one now. Listen, if she, if we don't sell this, we're gonna be living outside, and there's plenty of oxygen out there for her. Man, you right. But um, you better buy her another one. Oh, girl, you know what? I knew you'd come to your senses, and it's all right. Don't, don't you got insurance? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Insurance to take it. Insurance to take it. Yes, my order ready. Pick up my five. I ain't gonna make that. I ain't got no car. Call them. What? It's a customer. Um, how you know it's a customer? Because I got us a business line, girl. We professional. A business line. It better be a bootlet line. Cause let me tell you something, how can we afford any kind of line when uh, we can't even afford these bills? Uh, girl, it's an app and it's free, okay? Let me answer this phone for this month. Okay. 
Hello? Thanks for calling TM Games, where you have the best games in the system. Yeah, TM Games? Yeah, we got a problem. A problem? What kind of problem we got? See, I gotta pick up at five, but I ain't got no car. I don't mean a personal problem, sir. Well, it sounds personal, sir. That I, that's not my problem. You gotta come pick up your package by five o'clock to have it, okay? So I'm trying to see if y'all can mail it. Mail it? I mean, we can mail it, but it's gonna take like um three to five years for it to get to you. Three to five years? Who gonna wait that long? Yeah, yeah. You know, since the pandemic, the mailing and stuff all bagged up. Three to five years, or come pick it up at five. All right, man. I'm gonna try to get there, and I'll just go ahead and try to walk. But if I die, it's on you. Again, another personal problem, but I'll see you in the address. See you later, okay? Dang, man. This PS5 is worth it. I know you did just give out our address. Listen, either I'm going to send him the address or we won't have the address to send. You right. <laughs> man, this don't look like no gaming store. Man, this PS5 better be worth it. Man, this PS5 better be working, man. Better have them games to say to come with. What? <laughs> there you go. Hold on, wait. You gonna take it out there just like that? I mean, well, I guess you're right. You, you got a box or something? I mean, yeah, cause we want to at least make it look professional. Or is he gonna know we scamming him? Damn, man, I need to hurry up. We don't want him to know that till he gets to the house and my payment go through. Right, let's go get the box. See out the box. Now first, uh, don't open it till you get home, okay? Don't, don't open it till you get home. And um, we packaged it up really nice for you. It's all insulated and all that good stuff. And another, thanks for doing business with us. Thank you for the, and don't open it till you get home. Okay. okay. All right. And remember, no refunds. No refunds. I'm not gonna walk back over there. They ain't even use the real paper. What, what is this? What is this? This ain't no PS5. This old controller. Man, they scam me. Uh-uh, what is this? Eviction notice. Oh, I'm so tired of paying bills. Jesus. And where is Misha at? They didn't put an eviction notice on the door. I'm so tired of paying bills. Oh, what is you doing? Uh, yoga, duh, ain't this what it's for? Well, I don't 
don't see how you relaxing in a time like this. You need to be looking for a job. And I don't know why you asking me to look for a job. Well, you know I'm pregnant. Well, you being pregnant ain't stop this. <gasps> we getting evicted? Oh, Lord. Why you ain't tell me? Well, you would have known that if you went in here relaxing. Oh, Lord. What we going to do? I can't be homeless and pregnant. Well, if we don't come up with this money ASAP, that's exactly what you're going to be. Homeless and pregnant. Maybe some money. What she mean the nurse ain't finished the assessment? She ain't getting no $500 today. The nurse didn't finish the assessment? What she got going on? A little patient. The lady crazy. That's just a little dementia. We can take care of that. Oh, yeah. $3,000. Mm -hmm. I'm going to need that. $3,000? Um, Tiara, now what is that all about? Uh, something you ain't doing? Getting our bills paid? Uh, 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 and you tell me, how is you getting the bills paid? I started a caregiver business, and we just got our first client. Caregiving business? Um, I thought you said you didn't like old folks. You remember you said they stink. Well, sometimes you gotta do something strange for a little piece of change. <laughs> okay, let's get this house together for her arrival. Her arrival? She coming here? Uh-uh. I'm pretty sure that is not how it works. Do you want this rent paid or not? Or do you want to be pregnant and homeless? Yeah, I want the rent paid. Well, come on in. And you're relaxing. All right. Ugh. Ooh. I'm so tired. Jesus. Oh, I'm so tired. I'm tired too. What you tired from? You ain't even do nothing. I did. I picked up um one little piece of paper. Exactly. You ain't even pick up nothing. Now I'm talking about some you tired. You ain't even did nothing. I did all the work. Sure, I had to clean up all by myself and everything. You know what? I got to give me some help. Because if you can't even help me clean up, I know you ain't gonna help me take care of that lady. Shoot. Oh, <laughs> let me call my employee. You heard that? T and M Services, my employee. <laughs> let me call her. Not an employee? <laughs> With what money? She must think I'm stupid. Hey, Miss Austin, I was just about to call you. Hey, I just got a call from the client. What happened? Look, that wasn't my fault. Them people is crazy. Actually, like, do I get paid extra for that? That lady really needs some help. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. But we have a job for you here at the office. Yes, I've been trying to get out of this field for years now. When can I start? Uh, 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 right now. How, how soon can you get here? I will be there in 30 minutes. All right, then. I'll see you in 30. Okay, see you then. Bye. Hey, yes, I ain't got to work in the field more no more. Thank you, God, yes. Hey, hey. Well, look out, we here. Dang, this is nice. Yeah, babe, you smell with this one. Well, you know how to get the best to grandma. Yeah, I see. And look, I even got you your own personal person that can take your bags. Really? Yeah. Wow. Come Ooh, on, y'all. Come on. <laughs> see, Tier, you just a genius. I'm a genius. A scamming genius. <laughs> Them folks gonna know we ain't no caregivers. First of all, look at how we dressed. Dang, girl, I got all this to myself. Yeah, cause who wanted to be crushed up with us for six months? Yeah. Um, well, you picked the right one. You need to go and marry her. <laughs> See, that's why you need to lead the thinking up to me. They already asked us not to look like caregivers, so guess what? We good. Just chill. I got this. <laughs> Just like you had everything else, right? Dang, they got here fast. Wait, wait, wait. Check and see if they send you the money first, dummy. You know what? I keep you around for something. Whatever. <laughs> yep, paid in full. Hey, money, 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 money. Money. Okay, hold on, stop. You ain't the broke 
right now. Oh, you right, you right. But we is broke. Yeah, but we ain't got to act like it. Like, come on, let's go get this money. T-U-L-C, turn up for a check. Hey, y'all, come on in. You must be, yep, it's me and my lovely grandma. The one and only. Oh. Hey, y'all, this nice. Can we get a tour? Um, that'd be against the protocol. Right, Miss Austin? Right. Yes, we do not allow anyone past this point unless you're staying here. Man, what? I ain't never heard of that. Uh, well, you know, um, with COVID and all, we only allow the residents that's gonna stay here to actually come past this point. You understand that, right? Well, I'ma lead y'all to it. Bye, Grandma, I love you. Yeah, Grandma, I'ma let you enjoy your stay. Call me if you need anything. Alright, Miss Cohill, if you just walk to the back, I'll show you where you're gonna be sleeping at, okay? Do I need you to show me where I need to sleep at? Ain't y'all my slave? Y'all can take my bags. Uh-uh, we ain't no slaves. You can take your own bag. Uh, what she meant to say was her. Yes, Massa. Yeah, that's what I thought. Now y'all take my bag. I'm gonna go find out where I'm sleeping at. Look what you just got us into. Talking about our slave. This ain't finna work. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Uh, listen, we can do this. It's only for a month, right? A month? month? Yeah, eviction notice. We need the money. <laughs> uh uh, what's she doing here? Don't tell me. Uh, um, what is y'all doing here? Uh uh, what is you doing here? You stalking us or something? Yeah, you must be crazy. Um, I work here? Dang, babe, you went all out. You got my grandma three slaves. Slave? You know what? I ain't got time. I'm sure Miss Austin will explain everything to y'all. Yeah, 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 she, she, she gonna explain. explain. Oh, baby, where you going the house this way? What now? Oh, Lord, they know this ain't no real care facility. We ain't gonna go to jail. <laughs> we ain't going to no jail. They, they probably just forgot something. Now, get yourself together. We'll go see then. Come on. <laughs> We live here. What are you doing here? Why do everybody keep asking me that? I work here. Um, quit lying. You don't work here. Alicia? Um, uh, Miss Austin? Guilty? I knew this didn't look like no nursing facility. Y'all scam me. Nursing facility? Man, I thought this was an Airbnb. Um, yeah, I thought this was an Airbnb. You lying. You knew what this was. You little hacker. I knew you was up to something. Grandma, what you talking about? Don't grandma me. You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, you're right. I did put you in a nursing home facility because you was not fit to stay with us for no six months. And you know what? You and your grandma can stay here. I'm out. And y'all, y'all gonna get my money back. Uh, hold on, babe. Wait, let's go. You're right. We gonna do more than talk. Guess what? Because you finna catch these hands. Talk my butt. I'll take my fist and knock you upside your damn head. You know what? I quit. Well, actually, you can't quit because it ain't a real job. You know what? I'm calling the police. Oh, the police. Don't call the police. Hold on, hold on, hold on. How about we pay you? Uh, with what money? Uh, the money we just made. We just give us money. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm not taking nothing less than a thousand. Okay, a thousand dollars. We can do that. Just send me over your information. Okay. Well. Y'all not so bad after all. Yeah, you just had to get to know us, that's all. Well, nice doing business with y'all. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, and one last thing. We ain't paying you nothing, fuck off. No refund. <laughs> oh, uh-uh. You just said I'm not kidding. You always get us in trouble. Well, you need to get a job, it's your fault.
Want to learn how to design elegant clothes like these? Sign up for Royal Crown with School of Fashion. You won't regret it. designer. I mean, I'm creative. I got style or whatever. All I need is some fabric. Where am I get some fabric from? Ooh, that's it. See, this must be a sign from God. Look, fabric just falling out the sky. <laughs> okay, but before I get started on this drip, let me change my website name. Not t and Health Services, but t and M. Fashions. Ooh, I'm so fancy. I don't know why I be putting her name on everything. Misha ain't even here. She don't never do no work. But you know what? I ain't going down by myself. We going down together, baby. dresses by today willing to pay triple the price oh well i like what you're talking about ma'am you know what maybe being a fashion designer ain't that hard all i gotta do is get some pieces and act like i made it you, you get it i got it here we go now i know i got some dresses in here what that bag at that lady had left at the yard sale Dang, I still see you mad at me. But maybe I tell your surprise. 
that I got you, you won't be mad at me no more. Girl, it ain't nothing in the world to make me like you again. Well, I think I'll have to send these dresses back for royals then. Hold up! Did you say royal? Yes, ma'am. The royal? Yep, the one and only. Girl, shut up! Well, dang, you asked me a question. My bad, Bree. I still don't like you, but guess what? This means I don't hate you either. Well, that's a start. But I'm going to just give you the number so you can go pick up the dresses. Dresses? Girl, you got me two dresses for Royal? Yes, ma'am. Girl, today must be my lucky day. Yep, surely it's your lucky day. Now I'm going to go ahead and send you the number so you can go pick up your beautiful dresses. Okay, girl, I'll be waiting on the text, okay? Bye. Number? Why you ain't just send the address to the Royals? Um, it's Royals. They don't just advertise their address. You gotta be VIP just to have their address. Ooh wee! I'm gonna be the baddest thing with my royal dresses on. Miss Mary ain't gonna have nothing on me with her ugly self. <laughs> Let me see how many people reshared that new shoe I dropped. You know, they, they just be selling out, Lord. Let me see, let me see. Okay, share, share, share. Ooh, I already 10,000, what? 10,000, whoo! Uh -uh. What's this? T&M Fashion Boutique. The only boutique that sells royal custom-made dresses. what I'm seeing right now. Somebody selling the royal dresses for less than $10,000. The audacity. You know what? <laughs> I think I'm going to support this little T&M fashion. I'm going to pay them a little visit. Let me see where y'all at. Let me see. Okay, I'm on y'all little ugly website. Let me see. Must purchase something to receive the address to the palace. This little heifer the stole my whole entire setup. You know what? You wanna play? <laughs> Let's play. Let me order this. I got the money for it. It's the same house. I knew this heifer was up to something. Guess what? But I'm finna get to the bottom of this. Ooh, email. That was quick. Welcome to the palace. Child, please. You ain't gonna have a pot to piss in when I get through with you. Man, this girl got me effed up. I, who, I don't know who she thinks she is. Think she gonna put me in a nursing home? Then the same house? Oh, she got me messed up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, got my fashions ready. Dang, they here already? It's the easiest $3,000 I have ever made. Don't hate me. What that stink at? Uh, stink? You talking about Misha? Girl, I don't even know who that is. I'm looking for Bree. Bree? I don't know a Bree. The only person that lives here is me and Misha. Misha and her dog's going. Girl, don't play game with me. I'm talking about that stink you had, Bree. You know what? I think this is all a misunderstanding. I'm not in the caregiver business anymore. We are now fashion designers. <laughs> A fashion design? I bet you're about to say you sell royal dresses. Well, as a matter of fact, I do. The palace. I'm like a shack. Ooh, gosh. The door, if you call that a door, it was open. But the real question here is, who are you? My name is Tiara 
Austin, the owner of T&M Fashion Boutique. And who are you to be questioning me in my house? Girl, are you serious right now? That's Royal Cromwell. Cromwell, get it right. <laughs> Did I say owner? I mean, like, I'm really like an employee. Like, you know, I don't, my friend, she really owned it, Misha, but she not here right now. She's the owner. Mm-hmm. Well, just know, whoever the owner is, y'all gonna be hearing from my lawyer. Yeah, girl, you going to jail, but I'm gonna take my dresses and go on. Yeah, um, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna need these, so. Okay, you think you snatching something from? Do you know who I am? Don't snatch anything from me. Baby, I don't care if you was Jesus. Right now, these royal dresses belong to me. <laughs> um, y'all hiring, Mr. Royal? Girl, please. I'm suing y'all. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait, but it was me. It wasn't me. I got bills to pay. Baby, tell that to the judge. 